If a Carrington level solar storm hit today, what breaks first? The sun sometimes hurls coronal mass ejections, huge magnetic clouds, toward Earth. Most are harmless, a few aren't. When one slams into our magnetic field, it shakes electric currents through the atmosphere and even the ground. In 1859, telegraph lines sparked and worked without batteries. In 1989, Quebec lost power for hours. Now imagine that, today. High frequency radio drops, GPS gets noisy or fails, airlines reroute away from polar paths, satellites suffer glitches. On the ground, long power lines act like giant antennas, pulling geomagnetically induced currents into transformers. Enough current? They overheat and trip. Grid operators scramble to isolate damage. We can prepare. Space weather alerts, grid protections, safe mode for satellites, but a truly extreme storm would still be messy. So here's the question. If the internet, GPS and power vanished for 24 hours, what's your first move? 